What's up guys, it's Chris down here at the Mellow Vapes in Indian Land coming at you with a product video. Today we're going to be talking about the Lost Vape Quest or Orion Q as you may see it. Uh, it's kind of referred to as either the Quest or the Orion Q. Basically what it is, it's the non-DNA version of the Orion. So this is going to be a little bit different, it's going to be a little bit more simpler. Uh, this is my uh, personal Orion Q I've been using. There you go, it's just a black frame with the weave. I think that's what they call it. The pot on top. But we're going to talk about the one in the box. So today we're going to be going over the Orion Q. Uh, the one we are going over is, I'm not 100% sure the color combination on that, the black red shadow right there. So you get that little honeycomb kind of design with uh, black and red in the back. Looks super, super good. All right, we're gonna go ahead and uh, open this and take a look at it. All right, we're gonna pull this little sleeve off. You can get your box nice like that. Could be one of those little kind of fallout boxes. And here you're going to have your user manual. This is just going to go over the basics of the, the device, how to turn it on, how to, uh, well, basically just turn it on as there is no adjustment in this. All right. You're going to get a card telling you to wait five minutes before you, after, you fill, after you fill the pod, uh, just so the co cotton can get all saturated and juice can get to the coil before you fire it. Then you're also going to have the Lost Vape warranty card. Then you're going to be presented with your Orion and all the accessories. In here, here's your Orion. As you can see, that is the Red Dragon, I think, I believe. Yeah, Red Dragon. Or Red Shadow. But anyway, you can see it's just nice, sleek, and glossy right there. And that's one thing about these mods that you're going to notice is they just feel quality. They're nice, they got a good weight to them, nothing too heavy, nothing too crazy. 950 mAh uh, battery, so you can get good battery life, all day battery life. You got a Ryan Q on the side, you got Lost Vape Quest. So your fire button is going to be this button right here. It's going to be five clicks on. There you go, it's gonna flash to tell you it's on. And as you hold down the button, it's gonna light up. Uh, I believe purple is 100 is full charge, blue is a partial charge, and anything red is below 40%. So there you go. You got your micro USB right there, a little latch to release the pod. Go ahead and show you how that works. So there's a little latch to release the pod. You can press that down. And that is going to pop out the pod. There's the pod. Have a little airflow control right there. So you can make it a tighter or looser hit, depending on which one you want. You're going to fill it right up here on the top. See if I can, there we go. This just unscrews, you fill it up, then you just screw it back in. Pretty simple pod, uh, nowhere really for it to leak as the air flows on the top comes down. So then to put it back in there, you're going to take the front part, kind of see how it lines up. You take that front part, put it in there, kind of lever it in. Now you can either hold down the button and then let it release it once it's all the way down, or you can just click it right in. All right, yep, that was uh, my personal one. And here's the one we're going over. As you can see, it looks all nice, real sleek, uh, black frame. Then you're also going to get a lanyard with a little rubber piece that goes around your device. So then you can carry it on the lanyard. A little rubber piece right here. This is just going to go over the mod itself. Or you see how it works. And you are also going to get your micro USB cord. Cord. This is what you're going to use to charge the device. And uh, I'm back. Sorry about that. Uh, had a little bit of malfunction with my camera, but yeah, so this is the Lost Vape uh, Orion Q pod styles uh, device. Uh, one thing to note about this is it does not come with a pod. Those are sold separately. Uh, you're going to have to buy that uh, individually, well, separately on from this. So, just to let you all know, it does not come with a pod. So, anyway, but uh, if you're looking for a pod style device and you want something that's going to work very well, that's going to look nice, that is going to feel nice, and just all around be a good high quality product, if you just want a good quality pod style device, then this is definitely the way to go. They're one of the top of the line on the market. And so if you'd like to pick one up, stop on by, give it a check out, and I'll see you guys around.